Okay, welcome to Oliver Ames Field Hockey. They're playing Foxborough here at Moscato. Ball out of bounds. This is going to be a good matchup in the Davenport. Three and three against five and three. And uh, Foxborough is a formidable opponent. With the ball is Gaskill. She works it out to Costello. <coughs> Over to Welch. They work it up, but stolen by Foxborough and turned over at midfield. Costello up to Gaskell. Foxborough's all over it. Again, Malarsic. McLean goes across field to Welsh. She's working with it alongside, but Foxborough intercepts. And it goes out of bounds, so Emily Welch will take it in. Here comes Foxborough upfield. Ava Costello defending. There's a play up to Emily Welch. She battles, she'll retain possession. Works it back to <coughs> Costello. Goes through the middle on a nifty pass to Malarsic. I'm sorry, Tyler Delamere, my apologies. All right, Tyler's right there. And we get to see some numbers up close. So again, we know 39 is Lily Gaskell, who got her first goal the other day. Congrats. This is an important game for the Davenport because these two teams will be battling for the title. McLean works it back. Costello, she lets them come in a little. Gets defended. Gaskell on the edges. Costello intercepts, it hits a foot, out of bounds, so it'll be white ball. A lot of defenders in the way here, so she's going to lift it. Foxborough takes it, and they're going to give it to Foxborough. So nobody covering here. She's got some space. We're waiting for the lineup from Foxborough. So we looked online and couldn't find it at the Hawk. There's a nice feed, Delamere, to McLean, up to Georgia Costello, who's been on a scoring streak. That one goes wide. Probably the kiss of death right there. Saying something nice about someone usually leads to some challenges. So. Foxborough gets defended. Gaskell, who's been everywhere the last few games, works it over. Nice defense there. Nice feed along the edge. And it gets caught up by McLean. She works it up to Gaskell. Again, taken by Foxborough, but out of bounds. No ball girls today, so we'll have to fetch our own loose balls. There's Gaskell up to Costello. She works it across to Welch. A little bit of a trouble, but she maintains possession. Costello off to the edge. Once we get these numbers, we'll be able to read them a little better. Defense was outstanding against Taunton. Looking for another repeat of that. Ava Costello in the middle. She's going to work it back. That's a good play. This looks like Olivia Stevens. Nice hard pass off to the side. And she just doesn't retain it, but that's okay. We'll take that. Here comes Foxborough. They work it up. Stolen, but out of bounds. Not wasting any time. We're going to say it hit a foot, and it's going to be white ball. Oh, don't lift that one. There's no girls there. Oh, who am I? Georgia Costello comes up with it. Tries to go through traffic. Unsuccessful, but she's going to retain it. McLean goes over to Welch. Welch works it to the corner, I think, to caught him. There's Herman, but it goes far out of bounds. Ball's in for Foxborough. On it is Costello. She makes a move past one defender and then gets defended out of bounds. 
and she'll retain possession. She goes through the middle. That's a pretty good feed to Georgia. She was hoping that her line mate there, Delamere, was moving, but I think she was anticipating the pass. Again, the other day was the best passing game I've seen in a long time, so we're looking for a repeat. Nice defense there. Territorially, OA does pretty well. And this is no different so far today. Five minutes in. OA is going to take possession. Again, nobody's wasting time. There's a lift, Georgia. And they're going to call it the other way. Wish I knew what that rule was, but I don't, being honest. All right, there's a battle at midfield. They're going to give it to Foxborough on the exchange. Feed through the middle. Costello's right there. She's going to work it back, but back to uh, Olivia. And that one's going to stay in. I think that's Bornstein over there. Hoping to get a better look. Here comes Ava. She's going to try to work it to the side. She doesn't get everything on it. And Foxborough intercepts. Keeps it in. Stolen by Delamere. Who again the other day took a few off the hip. But good defense. They're going to give it to OA on the exchange. Eight and a half to go in the first quarter. No score. And matter of fact, no shots on net yet. With no ball girl, some of the inbounds are going to take a little longer. All right, through the middle, Georgia Costello. She's going to take it wide. She does beat her defender. Oh, she doesn't get the shot off. Good effort. Aaron into Costello. Oh, there's a feed and a beautiful pass. I think Delamere got her first of the year, 53. That's a wonderful play. Caught him to Costello to Delamere. Just a beautiful play. And that's the kind of passing we saw the other day that was the difference. So the Lady Tigers go up 1-0 against a very tough Foxborough team. These battles have been very recognizable year after year, so. A lot of game left here, seven and a half. So halfway through the first, one nothing, Lady Tigers. On a beautiful day at Moscato, October 1st. Ball's in. There's a give. I think that's Donovan. Waiting to see the number. Madeline Bornstein is who that is. Sorry about that, Madeline. We'll get her right next time. But she's been very good. The D has been outstanding. I think they limited Taunton to three shots the other day. And the offense has been equally good. They probably had 25-plus the other day. So the difference was the Bridgewater game we lost, and that game yesterday, or oh, two days ago, we put away. They're going to give it to Foxborough. Nice feed. Maya, we know Maya, she can play. It comes, oh, nice pass right there to Erin Cottom. Erin does not waste any time. Nice feed up to Georgia. This one gets broken up on a good play by the defense. And OA is going to take over. Through the middle. Ava to Olivia, oh, to Lily, doesn't quite connect. So now Lily and Delamere have their first goals of the year. And I'll call Delamere by her first name, Tyler. Here's a feed, but that goes out of bounds right away. Oh. And of course, Dottie Cottom's here. As usual, working. Thank you. I'll first do a mind. You want me to help you? No, I think I'm good. Thanks, son. So, Foxborough with the ball. Good steal by Emily. And Foxborough sends it up deep. 
They're going to let it go. She can't let it go. She tried. There's a feed, but Foxborough's right there. Oh. They turned the ball over inside the circle. There's a feed. Gets stopped. And I now have some numbers for Foxborough because Dottie caught him. Did the due diligence to get it for me. So thank you, Dottie. Always working for the program. All right. Didn't say eyesight was good, but I do see a few numbers out here. So Paige Simone is out there. Number eight. Ava on the ball. Emily. They're going to give it to Foxborough, who doesn't waste any time. At the 15, they try to squeeze it in. They do. They're going to turn it over with a foot foul, I think. All right. Ball up. Emily. Nice little feed. Nobody there. Foxborough turns it around at midfield. Nice feed up the edge. That is 26. So Megan Crabtree, again, great game for her the other day. She defends, but Foxborough retains possession. Good play by Olivia Stevens. Doesn't get the ball up, and Foxborough still has it. Ava on it. Let's see if someone can get this ball up. Nope, they're trying to force it. Ava's going to try to go across. Dangerous, though. There's too many blue shirts there. Oh, nice play there by Gaskill. She made a good play there. Ava defending. Good defense. Now there is Miss Wells. She had the best game. Abby Wells had an outstanding game the other day, number 60. I don't think too many got by her. As I said to the girls, if they play like they did the other day, their chances are quite good. All right, so eight with it. She feeds it up. Defended by Gaskell again, who's playing a lot of defense. Again, Paige Simone is number eight. Up, oh, they're going to get a corner. So we got, I think it's eight. I don't think it's nine, which is Mia Denunzio. The numbers aren't as clear as I'd like. And they're going to try to feed it into number three, who's in the middle, who is Kate Collins. Let's see if Kate gets this ball. And she does. Just outside the circle. She flips. I'll tell you what, they're getting in tight here, and Ava gets it out of the circle. Good play by Ava Costello, the senior co-captain. Don't fool around with it in that space. Too dangerous. So again, they're gonna feed it in. Trying to read some other numbers. I see 15s out there. I think it's Cam Collins, but I hope I got that right. Oh, there's a feed. Foxborough still in the circle. It hits a foot. They're going to get another corner. You got 21 out there. Val Vigel, if I'm saying the name right. She's right behind Collins. Here comes the feed from the corner. Pretty smooth pass. Nice feed. Oh, there's a goal. That looked like number nine took the shot and it got tipped. That's a pretty darn good goal right there. So that was Mia Denunzio on the shot. Let's see who has that ball. It looks like number, hmm, need a little turn there. 14, 14. So that would be Jenny Gallagher that scored that one. All right, away. Into the offensive zone. We got a game, folks. One to one, first quarter. One minute. Minute left here. Oh, good defense, Delamere. Georgia on it. She's going to work it back. Ava makes a nice feed to Emily. Emily up to Erin. Ah, oh, good defense. K 
can't quite make out the number, but a nice play by the defender for our Foxborough. Ava Costello. She feeds it to the middle. I think that's McLean that played it back, but Foxborough on it again. Up. Oh. Makes a move, but gets defended by Foxborough. And they're going to turn it over. There's only 20 seconds left, so pretty important play here. For the Lady Tigers, and they go out of bounds, so that's not what we wanted. 14 seconds. They're going to move quickly, If knowing Foxborough. They're a smart team. Just about 10. Stopped by Emily, but Foxborough retains. Nice D. Here comes Foxborough with a feed. Nice play there by Ava. And she's going to kill the clock. So nothing left first quarter. We'll go over the lineups here now while we have a free moment. 1-1 one, one after one quarter. And I honestly think there were only maybe one or two shots per side. So they made a count. You got Kate Collins, number three for Foxborough. I'm going to hopefully get these names right. Kira Davis, 10. Lily Jones, 88, who's the goalie. Morgan Osborne, 12. Kelly Richardson, 27. Paige Simone, 8. Catherine Cotta, 11. Paige Curran, 16. Mia Denunzio, 9. Jenny Gallagher, 14, who I think had the goal. Maya Warius, who we know well. Number 7, Val Vigil, number 21. Ella Campbell, 17. Isabel Chamberlain, number 4. Cam Collins, 15. Mary Collins, 6. Kaylin Connors, two, Catherine Ferguson, and Mary Quinn, if I've got, oh, Macy Quinn, I'm sorry, number 22. And we don't know if Catherine, Catherine Ferguson's either five or 77, so I apologize. Um, next up is OA. The Oliver Ames team is number two, Maria Messina, number six, Olivia Stevens, number nine, Fran Niosi. Number 11, Georgia Costello. Number 17, Emily Welch. Number 26, Megan Crabtree. Number 39, Lily Gaskell. We have number 39, yep, Lily Gaskell. Number 40, Madeline Bornstein. Number 42, Lauren Malarsic. 47, Erin Cottom. 48, Ava Costello. 51, Irene Pedro. 53, Maddie Prio. Proya. Number 53, Tyler Delamere, who I think had her first tonight. 56, Julia McLean. 60, Abby Wells. 67, Emma, Emma Donovan. 68, Annabelle Juste. 95, Megan Green. And 99, Tegan Kelly. So that's everybody we have in the lineup tonight, folks. And we are ready to start the second quarter. Fifteen on the clock. One one game. I guess they got three shots per side, so that was mistaken, but it was a pretty good defensive game for both teams. And here they come. Waiting for the Foxborough team. Ready to go. That's a nice feed to the side to Delamere. She's trying to get it back in. It's going to be OA ball. Get this camera moving from the from the ten. Back to McLean. She works it to the corner, but a little miscommunication there. So, no, uh, excuse me, Foxborough will take over. Ball at the 16. That ball is close to going out, but they keep it in. 
Nice defense by Gaskell. What a great play by Lily Gaskell. And she still has it. See if she can get it in. Oh, Georgia! What a play by Gaskell to Georgia. I will tell you what, maybe it was, that was just Lily Gaskell who defeated um, three defenders. She got by three with some pretty nifty moves and then fed it right to the middle on a one-timer to Georgia Costello. So nice goal for Georgia. I think that might be her 10th of the season. So good for her hitting that milestone. And what a great play by Lily. The team is starting to be very unselfish from what I can see. And that is a good sign. All right, so Foxborough, Foxborough back in the game, 2-1 OA. There was a nice feed from Aaron up the middle. Nice stop there. Bornstein. Foxborough in the middle. Georgia, she was looking for Aaron, but Aaron was long gone. Always trying to throw the ball to open space. Ava with a nice stop to Emily. Emily's going to try to go up the side. She does, but Foxborough's right there. And there's a feed. This looks like Bornstein. I'm going to double check. Megan Crabtree. There's a steal. Nice play. Olivia Stevens controlling the middle. Spot that was well controlled last year by Emily Hahn. They're going to give a corner, but I don't think the coach liked it. <laughs> a corner for Foxborough. Good defense from what I could see. And we do have a ball girl here, so that's great. I'm going to guess it's... Well, we'll find out, because we like to mention the people that are helping out. Might be 15. Nope, there's no 15. So anyway, here's the corner for Foxborough. To the middle. Oh, nice deke there. Look at this, they still have it. Oh, nice play by Ava. But they score. And we'll see, it was a couple of tips. Foxborough ties it up. Let's see who has the ball. It looks like she's gonna put it down at center. And that might be Gallagher again. I think it is. She's in trouble for the OA Tigers. 14, Vinny Gallagher. I have no idea who got the assist because a couple people were in tight. So we got a 2-2 game. 12 minutes to go, second quarter. We got a game on hand here. There was a hit, but they're going to call it a dangerous hit above the hip. So Foxborough takes it in. And they're able to move. They're able to move. That ball's going to go all the way down. So Owe will take over. Not sure where. We'll find out. Not sure what happened. Oh, they didn't realize it was a ball girl. Okay. Very good. Oh, what do we got here? She does fire it. That's a good feed to Delamere. Delamere to McLean. A claim back to Delamere. What a feed by Julia. Delamere can move. She feeds Georgia. Oh, she was trying to thread the needle. Good effort. And they still have it. Lily Gaskell all over it. Foxborough and Gaskell steals to Georgia. Oh, Georgia missed by inside of a foot. But I'll tell you what, Gaskell again. To her credit, beautiful feed. All right, Foxborough gets some real estate on that one. I'd let it go. They do. And OA will take over at midfield. They got some good movement. Emily. They call it a foot. I guess they're going to call it a foot. All right. Oh, that's a good stop. Georgia's got it. She makes a nice play to get by her defender. She's going to try to... Oh, she makes a nice play back to Emily. Emily gets interrupted there. Nice feed, but I think is going to take over. So... There's a feed. 
Olivia, center. Oh, not able to keep it in. Fox Bros gonna take it in at the 45. All right, we're back in the game here. Georgia feeds Delamere off to the side. Back to Georgia, who tried to do the one-timer again. Everybody's all over it here. Ava, she keeps it in. Oh, what a nice play. Here comes Ava. Feeds to the corner. Right in front. Caught him looking for someone. Nobody there, nobody home. Here we go. Oh, there's a miss by Ava. Swing and a miss. All right. Foxborough battling. We got a good game here. Oh, boy. Look at this, huh? Ava, great play. Works it back. Here is Wells. She tries to go across. That looks like it might have hit a leg, and it did. So they were fortunate because the girl was right where she needed to be. Here's a feed to McLean. Keep carrying. Nobody on you. She's going to forward it to uh, Delamere. See if she can get some uh, velocity on it. Oh, it gets through. Ah, they get it out. Good clear by the defender. Here comes Foxborough on the edge. And they're going to work it out. I would think that's OA ball. And it is. Good defense. That was off of number nine. Mia Denunzio. Oh, that one went straight up. Right to Foxborough. Seven on it. Again, seven is Maya Warius. Georgia on it. She has possession in the sun over there. She goes right through the girl, takes a swing, and they're going to turn it over with a dangerous swing. Swing and a miss. Ooh, right through the middle. You're gonna need to get possession. Oh, boy. Ah, miscommunication. It's all right. Keep trying, girls. Here's a feed in. And they're gonna call it the other way. All right. Possession to the middle. George is right there. I don't know what they're calling. I'm not sure what they're calling. Penalty? Uh, I don't know, but looks like one of the people, one of the players for Foxborough went off. So away. Ava makes a nice pass to Delamere, who's been open all day. She goes up the side. George has got to get there quickly. She does. He's calling it in. Look at this. Erin's got it. Oh, it's a late call there, my friend. <laughs> he was right there. He called it in, and then he called it out, which, by the way, I thought it was out. So I agree with him. It was just late. All right, so Gaskell up to Delamere. She's going to work it out here, so that'll be OA ball there. All right. Gaskell going to try to feed somebody. Someone's got to get open. Ava. See if Ava, oh, it takes a bad hop. Ava's going to work it back to Wells, across to Stevens. Stevens. Up the side. Nice feed. Up. Oh. Foxborough girls right there. Gonna give it to away, I think. She's gonna ask her to take it in somewhere. 
That is a number I can't read. All right, Ava's got it. She's going to try to change it up. She gets deflected. And then there's a nice feed. Good D. Oh, nice play to keep it in. Bornstein, I think that is. Ava. Yep, that's a good play there. Oh, she gets it up to McLean, who can move. She gives it to Delamere, who's been on this side, her on the right side, all day long. To Georgia. Oh, nice shot. Saved by the goaltender. Pretty good shot there. And a nice feed by Delamere. McLean's got it. Oh, she makes a good play, but it's defended outside the circle. There's a nice feed. See if she gets there, she will not. Nice effort. Nice effort by 14, who's got the two goals. Gallagher, Jenny Gallagher. All right, Gaskell, who's had a great game so far, lifts it. It's going to go to Foxborough, but look at this. McLean comes up with it. Defended by Foxborough. Georgia makes a legal play. She's going to try to work it back to her sister, Ava, and works it back further. And they're going to now try to move it up. Ava brings it across. Oh, she makes a great deke. But, oh, look at this. McLean's got it in the middle. Oh, what a great play on D. I got to get that number. That was a heck of a play. Ava trying to thread the needle. And that one's going to go out of bounds. I think it's going to be OA ball. All right, Gaskell's got it at the 40. She makes a nice play over to Delamere, who gets through. Oh, she doesn't see, but she tried to make the same play, feed the middle. All right, so this is 40. No, it can't be. Hard to read it. Might be Malar's side. Oh no, Bornstein, okay. In the middle. Foxborough, nice play there. That's going to go out of bounds. Two and a half to go in a 2-2 game. This is anybody's game, folks. Battle for Davenport. Supremacy. Oh, nice play. Here's Ava through the middle. She's going to make a couple moves. She gets it in the middle. That's a good feed. Look at this. Gaskell to Delamere. I'll tell you what, she made a good feed to the middle. She has played a great first half, Tyler. Girls are moving the ball well. This is a this is gonna be an interesting game. All right. 21. Uh, working it up. Midfield. She falls and Ava comes up with it. Oh, but it goes to a Foxborough defender. 21 was Val Beagle for Foxborough. There's a feed up the side. Nice feed. George is kind of waiting for Aaron, and uh, neither one of them got to it in time. Number seven's over there. Maya. Let's see who's got this ball here. That's a nice feed, but it goes out of bounds. They're still going to give it to Foxborough. Oh, that one's deflected, and they're still going to give it to Foxborough. All right. This woman usually calls a great game as the referee, so very consistent. Here's a feed up the side, number two. That would be Kaylin Connors. There's a nice move by the OA defender. And I guess that's either Madeline or Megan. There's a feed to mid midfield, 40 seconds left. Clock's a tick and that one gets through. Nice play by Stevens, clearing the middle. Foxborough ball with a half a minute to go. I don't know what's going on there, but she's gonna make sure she's got the right ball. Foxborough knows what they're doing. 
Got to be careful here. Nice play by Stevens. Ah, doesn't get out though. And we're down to 10 seconds. She's going to have to move, and I know she knows it. She to the middle. It's a foot, and they'll turn it over, and that'll be the end of the first half. So we got a 2 2 game. Two goals by Jenny Gallagher, and a goal by Tyler Malarsuk and Georgia Costello. So we got a 2 2 tie at halftime, and we'll be back in just a moment, folks. Thanks for joining us on ECAT. This is Larry on the camera and the audio, and I want to thank Dottie for her help. And welcome back, folks. Second half, Oliver Ames in Foxborough, field hockey, Davenport championship kind of on the line. It's early in the season, and these girls got to play again, but every game against Foxborough and Canton is, uh, is for some positioning towards the Davenport championship. So... Uh, North Attleboro will probably be in the mix, and some of the other teams are battling as best they can as well. But this Foxboro team's always been somewhat of a thorn in our side, and that's, that's a credit to them. So, and I'm sure they feel the same way. So we got some numbers here. There's 15. I can see a clear picture of 15. Cam Collins. It's either, I think it's Cam. Uh, let's see. We got uh, six. I like to call names here while everybody's standing still. Mary Collins. Uh, 11, 14. 11 is Catherine Cotta. And here we go. So Foxborough's going to take out. They go back with it. Aaron's right on it. Now look at this. Emily to Georgia. Georgia, oh, it gets deflected. No whistle. I guess it is a whistle finally. All right, Emily is gonna take it from the 45. She's gonna find somebody that's open. She doesn't, she gets it to Erin, but Erin was covered. Emily, you gotta get rid of it. She doesn't, that's okay. She was looking, trying to be patient. There's a good play there. That hit a foot, they're still gonna, they're still gonna call it. Ava on it, Emily on it. Six has it. Mary Collins. Mary's looking for a player. She goes through the middle. Emily gets her stick on it. She's got a good reach. There's a nice feed. Not enough on that one, though. And Foxborough maintains possession. Oh, nice play there. Right back, though. That ball's off to the side. Look at this. Nice play by... Uh, that's got to be number 60 there. I think it is. And she is good, very good in the middle. Abby well, Wells. So they're going to take it at the 20, I believe. 25. All right, White, let's see if we can gain possession here. Oh, that's a tricky play. I like that play, actually. Oh, six is on it. She's not giving up much real estate. Nice flip. She's going to get it up again. She does. And I'll tell you what, Erin can move if she can keep it in. She does keep it in. She's trying to get to the net with one hand. She cuts across. She's with Georgia. They're going to turn it over there. I like that play. A couple nifty plays here. One by Foxborough, one by OA. There's a feed to the side. Emily Welch right there. Defending, Foxborough number three. Boy, she gets it up to 15 with some speed. Kate Collins, a lot of Collins girls. 15 on it, that one takes a good bounce. I'll tell you what, it goes all the way through. Be interesting to see whose ball it is. They toss it up, they're gonna give it to Foxborough here. So far, Foxborough has had most of the possession in the second half. First half was back and forth. Can't quite see who that is. I think it's number eight, Paige Simone. Oh, there's a good, yeah, they're going to give it their way. Body contact, but it was just uh, circumstantial. Ah! McLean is there. She's going to get possession of it. 
I mean, really, does she give the ball up? It's going to go back to... There's a lift. And they're going to give that to Foxborough. They have possession. Nice play. Ava steps up. Look at that move. Ah, too many to get around, though. A lot of Foxborough girls here around the ball. You know it's coming across. Nice defense by Wells. She's just very good positionally. Foxborough will maintain possession. 11 to go in the third quarter. Tight game. Both teams have about five shots. Look at this. Good D. I think that's Gaskell, but I'm not positive. Look at this. You got Aaron Cottom, who I'll tell you what, nobody works as hard as Aaron. There she is. Two girls. They're going to give her the ball because she was moving it. Oh, that's a, that's a good steal there. Number three, Kate Collins. Uh, these girls have good stick skills. Both teams do. Both teams do. All right. We're looking for some movement. Kind of hoping she goes to Stevens here. She doesn't, but she makes a great feed up the middle. Tell you what, that's a great feed. Georgia, if she didn't get slowed up, I think she would have been gone. What a wonderful feed, though. Well, there's a feed to the middle. Good steal by Stevens. She goes up to Erin Cottom. Erin's going to feed the middle, but George is a little gassed from that last run, I think. Megan Crabtree with some great feeds from out back. Here's Ava on D. She makes a good play. There's Megan. Oh, it gets stolen by one of the Collins girls. Ava's got it. See if she can get this ball up. Oh, she makes a good deke. She fakes like she's going to pass, and then she just makes that deke. But she's running out of real estate here, so. They're going to give it to OA. See if Ava maintains. Nope. She's going to hand it off and be a safety valve. Here's a nice feed to McLean. McLean's trying to get that ball up to Georgia, who maybe she refilled her tank. Nice feed up the middle. Look at Erin's right there. Aaron just missed it. And look at her. Just never gives up. Never gives up. Nice feed for Georgia across the field. All right, back to 42. Lauren Malarsek. This girl can play 15. And I have said her name. 15 is uh, Kim Collins. 42 on it. Oh! Gets Gaskell. Oh, she runs right into the Foxborough girl. And they're going to give that to OA. Both refs are. Yeah, that was a collision. I'm glad to see everybody's okay, but I think it was forehead to forehead. All right, everybody seems okay, which is all that matters. 42. Lauren. Back to Ava. There's a nice feed up the sideline. It just goes out of bounds, and that would be Miss Wells. She uh, usually hits that ball with authority. Ball in play. Nice. Here comes McLean. She's going to try to beat her defender. She cannot, but the girl does send it out of bounds. I say the girl because I can't see her number. magnifying glass but uh, good to play good play on defense by sending it out of bounds and gaining some coverage back on D all right I'm gonna take it from the 20 15 no, from the 12 back to Ava Ava to McLean who sends it across oh what a play by the goaltender great play by the goaltender Lily Jones. Play in the middle. McLean, she's going to say she took it out of bounds. 
but that was some good skill set right there. This ball's not out of bounds. Foxborough maintains possession. Ava, she steps up, still gets her ball. Good hustle. Cross. Got to stay, keep possession there. Right, that's Donovan there. I'm sorry. Madeline Bornstein gets it up. McLean across the middle. Aaron caught him. What a play. Oh, Aaron, I didn't move the camera. That was a heck of a play. It just missed. She is playing some spirited ball today. I got caught watching the play there. I'll pay for that one, Dottie, won't I? All right, so Foxborough's going to take it out. And I'll tell you what, between her and Georgia just missing, and their goaltender coming up with some big plays. This is a tight game still. Here's a steal. Not an entire steal of possession. Warius gets it up to Collins. To the middle. Number three. Ava's going to try to send it up. She does. Nice feed. Now we got some movement. Malarsic. McLean trying to get it back to Malarsic. McLean makes a good move there. She's got full possession. She sends it. That's got to be a corner. Now they're saying it was above the knee, so we're going to turn it over there. That's too bad. But the D paid the price and nice defense for Foxborough. Oh, boy, there's a feed that goes pretty far up, and it's going to stay in. Nice feed. She keeps it in. Oh, but there's two defenders there. Nice play. Foxborough. They make a nice play. Good defense by Crabtree. That one gets through. Shoot, they got a two-on-one here, folks. Nice defense by Wells. It's okay if we're going to give up a corner. She just prevented a goal there. Abby Wells. Excellent defense. All right. Both these teams are skilled. Let's see. Four and a half to go, third quarter. TikTok. They have an interesting setup. All right, she's going to stop that one, feed it. Oh, they try to go back to her, and they do. And she's going to try to. It went wide. I'll tell you what, that was just like Erin's. It went by by inches. So, OA dodges a bullet there just like they did. Everything's about even here. That was a good play. They have a nice corner at Foxborough. All right, away bringing it up. You gotta move that ball, and they do. McLean's gonna go up to Georgia on the side. Georgia, oh, she's getting defended big time. She sends it across, though. Oh, Aaron did a one-timer and just missed it. Nice feed by Foxborough. <laughs> Excuse me. 26, back to Ava, who's going to work back to Stevens. So that was Crabtree to Costello to Stevens. You got Wells back there. Stevens, that hits a foot, no whistle. Here comes Ava. She's playing a great game tonight. Along the edge, feeds McLean. McLean's going to get that ball in. Oh, the defender was right there, and they're going to give her the ball. She's going to maintain possession. Oh, and now she just took it. She didn't wait. Look at that. Erin. Georgia. Oh, look at that. Erin caught him. The due diligence in front of the net gets a rebound off Georgia's shot from McLean. So McLean Costello caught him and caught him, puts him up 3-2 on a huge goal. And that was just pure hard work, waiting for the rebound. Good for her. She's been one of the hardest workers this year, so she's only a... Sophomore, nice big goal for her. And the OA Tigers go up 3-2 with 2.48 to go. Nice play by Georgia to keep that in play and put it off the pads. And McLean made a great play to start it, so. Great teamwork. All right, Foxborough with possession. Every possession matters here. Georgia steals. She goes to the side, but there was a little too much emphasis on that one. And I guess they're going to bring it back to center. 
42 is going to take possession. That would that is Lauren Malarsa. And let's see what she does with it. She goes off to Emily. Emily's going to try to move it. Not quite. It hits a leg, so they're going to say get back. Oh, they. All right. They maintain possession. See if she goes to Erin. She does, but Erin's not there. She was going in a different direction, so good idea. All right, Foxborough. Oh, look at this. Out of bounds, so OA will take over at the 45, maybe? Yeah. Oh, she's got plenty of players, but I think they're not communicating too well here because they had a bunch of players open in the backside. One of those balls has to get... There you go. All right, Foxborough. Oh, good defense by Aaron. And that's going to go out. Yep, and it's going to be OA ball at the 35. Crabtree. Oh, she's got to be careful. Ava. Look at Ava. Nice deke to Crabtree. Get it up. She does. Oh, good steal. That's a great steal by number six. Mary Collins. And here comes, look at this steal by Olivia Stevens. She gets defended, but they're going to give her the ball. I think she's looking to get it up to Erin, but it doesn't make it. There's just too many defenders in the way. That ball might make it out. I think she's waiting for it, too, and it does. Good play by Crabtree. And I believe now I know her first name, Megan. All right. Here we go. A lot of defenders there. Ooh, that's almost a whistle, but no whistle. Erin's on it. She's going to try to do a little dance. Nope. Foxborough maintains possession. Emily. Warriors can play. Oh, look at this. Nice play by Stevens on D. Up to Emily. She doesn't quite get the right contact. Nice flip. Here comes Foxborough through the middle. Ooh. Defense. Wells is there. Ava, she clears it, and it'll be a corner kick. Six, Mary Collins made a couple of nice nifty moves there. Oh, and that's the end of the third quarter. Uh, but they do get the corner before the quarter ends. So that's, we have to play that out here, folks. Big opportunity for Foxborough. All right, the play doesn't die until of a whistle. See what happens. All right, it's out. Two, three. Over to seven. Back to three. Oh, oh it went wide. Another just miss for Foxborough. Each of them have two of those. This game couldn't be more. Couldn't be more even. Nice bid. All right, we'll be back for the third quarter here in two minutes. All right, folks, we're back for the fourth quarter. Oliver Reigns maintains a very slim 3-2 lead on an Erin Cottom rebound goal that was uh, well-deserved. So you got Cottom, Costello, and Delamere on the goals tonight. Plenty of help from the side, and, you know, McLean and... George has got an assist in there, um, a couple. So, good defense so far. Wells, Stevens, Crabtree, um, Bornstein. Just looking at these names here. Um, Welch has been on the ball a lot. Gaskell's been on the ball quite a bit. Bornstein, Malarsuk. Overall, uh, Delamere, overall, this team has really improved a lot, and I guess you got to give the coaches credit, Sharon Lawrence and her staff. These girls are playing with some spirit and some skill. All right, let's see what we got. We're in play here. Foxborough ball again. Aaron's on it. Gets it up to Collins. This girl's been on the ball a lot, too. Georgia wins that battle. Oh, I think it might have hit her foot. Nope, they're not going to call it. Here comes Georgia. Oh, she went right into Warius, I think. So that's not going to end well when you run into her. Ava. Oh, she gets tripped. She's okay, I think. They're going to give her the ball back. 
she gets tripped by M Mia, who is a tough character. So, all right, Ava with it. Let's see who she goes to. She goes to Emily. Emily's going to try to get it up. She does. That one's going to go all the way, and I don't think Georgia's going to get there. So, good effort by Georgia. Another one that puts in 110 percent. That's all you can ask. All right, so that's going to be Foxborough ball. And the ball girl helps us out greatly with that. There's a feed to the middle. Right on it. There's a number I don't recognize. Maddie Proya, 52. Well done. Good to see Maddie out there. I think she's been out there. I just hasn't been on this side. All right, back to Ava. She's a little bit verklempt, but she gets it off. Here it is to uh, Stevens. Wells gets it up. Nice feed. Good play. Look at this. Oh, they're going to say it hit the body and turn it over. Can't do much about that. That's a nice play. Coming up the side. Oh, it's a feed to the middle. Doesn't quite get to the middle. So 13 minutes to go. Tight game. Could go any way here. All right. Foxborough ball at the 15. Everybody's in position. Through the middle. Aria Sonic. Ava defending. Comes Collins. Ava has it. She's got to get rid of it. She does. Nice feed to the outside. You got to move the ball quick with Foxborough. There's a nice feed to McLean. McLean doesn't waste any time. Georgia, uh, not quite, huh? Just off a little. Again, though, Foxborough's all over this ball. Look at Ava. She's going to let it just let it go out. She does. Smart play by the senior co captain. She's looking. She's looking. She's going to try to go to McLean, who. Oh, I, she fell down. Oh, good play by McLean to maintain possession. Here comes Ava. She's trying to switch hands. Oh, she gets it, but can't get through. Good defense by Foxborough there. They still have possession. Some of these girls are getting weary. Oh, nice play by Wells. Again, uh, Foxborough maintains possession, but nice play by Wells. Here's a playoff to way too far for me to read the number, but oh, that's uh, McLean, I think. Tell. She's, uh, she's got a good reach herself and quick. Probably going to do her some good when she's looking at schools. All right, here comes Foxborough. Through the middle, George is right there. She's going to feed, but... Eleven's going to let that go out of bounds because she's smart. She's very smart. Let's see what her name is so I can mention it. It's Catherine Cotta who lets it go out. They send it back up. All of her aims, but they lose possession. That's going to be OA ball. 10.59 left in this game. It's been a good one. There's a lift. Oh, look at this. She still has it. All right. To the middle. Oh, no wasting time inside that circle. Somebody goes down. They're calling it OA ball. George is open in the middle, and a few others. Oh, it gets stolen. That's good D. Foxborough just knows how to defend. All right, OA ball. See if we can get a little creative here and get this ball in. David knows she's got to send it. Nice deke. She sends it. Oh, it hits a foot. It's going to be OA ball. Ah, oh, another one. But again, they know how to defend. Regardless if it hits the foot, it's a defending of the ball to the middle. So, nice idea. You earn your goals in this game, folks. All right, five, uh, five yards. Georgia makes a great play to steal it. She has it. Oh. Look at that. She passes to Erin Cottom, who buries it. And they go up 4-2. That was quite a play. Georgia fed Erin inside the circle. It was a one-timer. And I'll tell you what, that's a skill play right there. Huge goal. Cottom gets her second of the game. Georgia gets her third assist. 
They're working well. McLean did some good things early on there, too. All right. The sophomore comes up big. Got it. I might have missed her missed opportunity early, but I got her two goals, so give credit where it's due. All right, Foxborough. Possession. Look at Erin go. She's looking for a trick. You can, tra you can tell. Oh, nice steal by Emily Welsh. Gets it up to Erin. Erin through the middle. A little bit slower than I'm sure the line mate would like, but Foxborough's not going to be shy right now there. They're going to play full throttle. Nine to go. Down two. That one was not a well-planned transition. It hit the foot. So Ava's on it. She's going to try to play it back. Yes, that's the right play. Olivia doesn't fool around with it. She's going to go over. Emily does make a good play. She's going to try to go to Erin, but she's not there. She's everywhere, but she wasn't there. Emily's not going to give up too much real estate here. Ava. You got Maddie Proya right there. That's it, Maddie. Nice feed to Emily, but it gets defended. It comes Foxborough. Nice feed. Ava on it. It hits her foot. Six is dangerous. That's all I know. Ah, they clear it. Not quite. Refs. Oh, that's got to be. That's a ball out on Foxborough there. I don't know if I like that call. But Olivia was all over it. So nice play. Olivia's still on it. Now they're going to give her the ball. That's hard work for Olivia Stevens. She's going to go hard, but look at that. Is that that's three? She's been all over the ball too. Ava's going to try to. She does. She threads the needle with Erin. Erin's going to go up to Georgia. See if Georgia can make a move. She does. She's going to try to dish it back. I think. Oh, she goes to the middle and fires it, but it just goes wide. It went off the defender. I would have thought that's always ball. I think it will be. Nice move, Georgia. She had to work for that one. She couldn't tell I got caught up in the play. All right. McLean's got it at the 25 at the hash mark. She's going to play it back to Ava. Ava's going to try to create separation. It hits a foot back to Ava. Give it over. She does beat her girl, but they're playing tough D, as always. As always. Here comes McLean. She doesn't give up much. That's a good play back to Stevens. 6.50 to go. She's going to go hard to Emily. Emily has been playing great the last two games. Focusing on that ball. She's got to be pretty far away from it with her height. And she does a good job. Here comes Olivia. Cross field. That one's going to be a little too high. A little too much gusto on that one. Here comes Foxborough. Uh, they're going to be gunning for one here. Through the middle. Nice play by McLean, but they're going to call a foot. And uh, Foxborough will maintain possession. Six to go. We're going to change goalies. Seems a little strange, but that's what we're going to do. So good for them. Uh, that goalie played very well. She got beat by one-timers, so hard to defend those. All right, Foxborough with the ball. And oh, that's a nice feed. Got to keep playing. She does. Look at this play. Gets it up to, I think that's Ava over there. No, it's not. Nice feed. Here they come. Defended. Oh, nice recovery. She's going to send it to the middle. Erin's not open. They're really double teaming her now. To the middle. I think George is trying to conserve. Five and a half to go, folks. Oh, nice play. 
I want to get that number. I wonder if that's 14. That's a nice play by the Foxborough girl. Oh, Ava's got it. She turns it up. She's got to make some... Oh, nice move for Ava. She's got that move down pat. I want to see who that was. I can't tell. I feel bad because the girl made a heck of a play. All right, they make a substitution. Under five to go here. TikTok. All right. Ava is going to go across to Emily. Emily is going to maintain and go through the middle. A lot of blue there. Georgia. Oh, she makes a good move. But look at Foxborough does right back at her. Ava. Good stick skills. Here she comes. Let's see if she's going to feed. She does. Good defense. Look at this play. Oh, nice give and go. I'm going to turn it over to Foxborough here. 420 to go. Right now, the second half belongs to Erin Cottom. All right, Ava defending, but again, she's going to be a little weary. Here comes an odd woman rush. Oh, good D. Ava, nice back check. That's just great work. Oh, he's got four back. And that's just good defense. That's what that is. All the way out, here comes Foxborough. They're gonna go hard to the middle. Great D by Olivia Stevens. Here comes away. They gotta get it by her. They're not gonna get it by her. She's too good. That one goes out of bounds. Foxborough ball. 3.30 to go. 4-2 game at Moscato, October 1st. And here comes Olivia, good read, great anticipation. She sends it out of bounds. Look at Erin just going 100 miles an hour, but she's not going to catch that one. It had too much, again, velocity on it. All right, here we go. This girl can be tricky. Number six for Foxborough, Mary Collins. She doesn't get it by Emily, but here comes Gallagher, dangerous player, as we know. In the corner, Bornstein, I'm sorry, Proya, Proya. All the girls are giving it all they got. Just under three minutes. Proya's going to try to... Oh, she goes to Emily. Emily makes a great play there. Here's uh, Cottom. Cottom makes a good deke. She's going to try to take it up and drive it. There she does with her move to the middle. And she's going to go up. Again, Georgia's just a little low on gas. Nice steal by McLean. Let's see if she can make a play here. She does. She's getting close. Oh, I think she might have hit the post or the girlies pad. And we're going to get a corner with 2.20 to go, which is huge for OA because they're up two. And I give uh, Julia McLean credit. She made that play just about on her own. Nice feed by Cottom. Here we go. McLean's going to feed the middle. It goes to Georgia. Oh, the girl defends it. You got uh, Stevens. To Georgia. Oh, they almost buried it. Caught him almost had a trick. She tried to tip it, and uh, it just went wide. So, minute 45, and I think Foxborough knows they got to move this ball. Them, <laughs> they're a bright team. Here they come. They're moving it with authority. 14 Galaga. You know her name. Nice defense by Ava Costello, uh, one of the better players for Foxborough. Here they come right back. You got Proya there. A lot of blue coming up. Stevens is back there. Look at that play by Stevens. Nice defense. No whistle, but we'll take it. Minute 15 to go. And they're not going to waste any time here. Minute 10. Oh, look at Erin. Oh, it hit Erin's foot. She was gone otherwise. Just a minute to go. Foxborough knows they're moving with enthusiasm to the middle. Oh, that gets deflected by Stevens and still in play. Nice play by goaltender Green, I believe it is. Play to the middle. Look at this. They're going to say it hit a foot on Foxborough and it'll be always ball. That's a huge turnover. 40 seconds to go, two goal lead. We're not going to jinx them. Let's see if we can clear this ball. Olivia Stevens doesn't waste a lot of time up the side. It's a smart play. 
Ava's just trying to get in the way at this point. 30 seconds to go. Away ball. Drive it one more time. You probably got it. Georgia. She's going to try to make a play. Look at this. She does. See if she can get by these. One more. Why not get feed somebody in the middle here? She does. She's killing the clock. Keeps it in bounds. Emily. And that's going to be two seconds, one second. That's a huge 4 2 win for the OA girls who go six and three and move into a tie for first place in the Davenport. So credit to everybody and a credit to Foxborough who had a tough week this week and they showed up to play today. So uh, we wish them the best and we will see them again. And I'm sure that game's going to be just as tough as this one. Thanks, folks, for joining ECAT. We will talk to you soon, and we appreciate Jason and the team providing the equipment. Kim and Joe and the rest over at ECAT, they do a wonderful job. Eastern Cable Access Television. Have a great weekend, folks. We almost forgot the chair. <laughs> Here it is. Nice job, girls. Nice job, Coach Lawrence.